In this video, I will quickly show you how to set up an Aredo eSIM on your iPhone. So this is simpler than you may think. All you need to do is go and open up the Aredo app on your phone. Then here select whether you want a local eSIM, which will be available in one country, a regional, which will be in one continent, or global, which will work all over the world. I'll just get a local eSIM for, let's say, Japan right here. And I'll just take the cheapest one since this is just an example and click on buy now. Now here, just make sure that you pick the correct one and then click buy. Now for the payment method, you can pick it right there and then just go to pay for it. And then before you pay for it at the bottom, you will see before completing this order, please confirm your device is eSIM compatible and network unlocked. So make sure that is the case. You can click on learn more and then you will see if that is actually the case for you. For me, it is. So I'll click pay and now I've bought this eSIM right here. So now what you can go and do is click on go to eSIM details. Now, in order to go and install it, all you need to do is click on view instructions right there. Now here you will see the steps. So I recommend just doing direct right here. So you can see the steps here, but at the bottom, just click install eSIM, then click next, then click next, then click install eSIM, then go and click on allow. Now here it will say activate eSIM, so it's connecting to your phone. So now click continue. Now, by the way, you should only activate it when you are actually going to use it because it does have a certain validity range of, for example, seven days, 14 days or 30 days. So if I activate it now and it only and it only works for seven days and I go on vacation in two weeks, then in those two weeks, it won't work anymore. Now here you can go and choose which one you want to turn off that you currently have on. Now, normally you need to click on primary, but I don't actually want to use it. So I'll click turn off business. And now mobile plan setup is complete. Your webbing eSIM is now active on this iPhone. So click done. Now here you can set it to your primary, but if you want to change it later, you can still customize it in settings. I'll set it to secondary. Now here again, you can set it to your phone number or to the secondary, which is what I'll do in this case. And now again, you can set it to primary or secondary. Usually if you want to use it right now, just set it to primary. Now you can allow mobile data switching and you can read what it is, but for now I'll just click continue. And now you will see your eSIM has been successfully installed. So that's all you need to do. It's super straightforward. They just take you through all the steps. And by the way, if you bought the eSIM on desktop, they can just scan the QR code right here next to the direct section with your phone in order to also install it. So now you know how to set up an Aurelio eSIM on iPhone. If this video was helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. With that being said, I'll see you in the next video.